other than the presidential election, it may be the most watched race in the nation this year. Republican Tim Sheehy challenging Democratic incumbent John Tester for Montana's open U.S. Senate seat and possibly control of Congress. Well, tonight, less than three weeks until the election, a new report is raising more questions about the injury she claims to have received while serving in the Afghanistan war. Been about 93 countries around the world, carried a gun in a lot of them. Republican U.S. Senate candidate Tim Sheehy certainly has an impressive resume. The father of four and successful Bozeman businessman is a former Navy SEAL who served in Iraq and Afghanistan. My wife and I both served uh, overseas. Uh, she was a Marine Corps officer, me as a Navy SEAL team leader. And MTN was there in 2015 when he was presented a Purple Heart for another injury sustained during his time in combat. You learn a lot in military service. You learn the power and the greatness of this nation. But now new questions are surfacing about Xi's military service, specifically how he was injured in combat. New reports published Friday in both the New York Times and the Washington Post detail accounts from two people now casting doubt on Xi's version of the events. In October of 2015, Xi received a citation for illegally discharging a weapon in Glacier National Park. At the time, Xi claimed his gun fell out of the back of his vehicle and accidentally fired with the bullet hitting him in his arm. She later admitted that wasn't true. He and his campaign then said the injury occurred in 2012 while she was serving in Afghanistan, telling the Washington Post he didn't report it at the time because he received no treatment for the injury and said it didn't affect his ability to do his job and that she wanted to protect his platoon mates by not triggering an investigation. When I was 18, I was carrying a gun in defense of this country. But now the park ranger who issued the citation in Glacier has come forward telling the New York Times he's 100% certain she received a gunshot wound in the park. And a former colleague and fellow Navy SEAL is also questioning Xi's account of what happened in Afghanistan, saying the two met after the alleged injury occurred and that there were no signs of any injury. We did hear back from the Xi campaign tonight who called the story in part a pathetic attempt by John Tester through an activist to disparage an American warrior. Xi saying in that statement that he won't let any of this quote slander stop him from fighting every day as Montana's next U.S. Senator. He continues to lead in most polls.